Moto G Power. Best phone $199. A step back for Motorola's long-lasting phone. The Moto G Power 2022 lasts a long time on a charge and the 64GB model costs less than last year's version. But an underpowered processor leads to laggy app launches, and you may be better off with the 2021 version if you want a long-lasting device without the sluggishness. Pros Battery lasts all day and then some. 6.5-inch screen is a pleasure to look at. Helpful gesture support. More storage and base model. Cons. Noticeable lags when launching apps. Camera struggles with lighting. Dim display. Only one Android update. The Moto G Power has firmly established itself as the phone to get in Motorola's G Series lineup of budget handsets, and it's easy to understand why. If you want one of the best cheap phones that lasts all day and then some on a single charge, you turn to the Moto G Power, whether it was the 2020 or 2021 versions. With a pitch that's straightforward, you can see why Motorola keeps cranking out new versions. And the beat goes on with the Moto G Power 2022, which arrives not even a year after the Moto G Power 2021 made the scene. Motorola is eager to keep the long-lasting good times rolling. But while the latest Moto G Power still has the lengthy battery life enjoyed by its predecessors, Motorola's made a key change that makes the new phone a less compelling budget option than before. Moto G Power 2022 Review, Price and Availability You can now pre-order the Moto G Power 2022 in advance of the phone's March 18th release. Best Buy opens a new tab, and Amazon opens a new tab, or taking orders now, as is Motorola.com opens a new tab. You'll pay $199 for the 64GB version of the Moto G Power 2022, which is an improvement over the Moto G Power 2021, that phone only included 32GB of storage in its $199 version. Motorola also sells a 128GB Moto G Power 2022 for $249. Color choices include Dark Grove and Ice Blue. Moto G Power 2022 Review Cameras Not much has changed on the camera front since the Moto G Power 2021. On the 2022 model, Motorola has bumped the sensor on the main camera to 50MP, up from 48MP, but you still have the same macro camera and depth sensor that the last Moto G Power offered. That's not the worst thing in the world, as the older Moto G Power generally produced serviceable if not spectacular shots, certainly nothing you'd be embarrassed to post or share. Moto G Power 2022 Review Performance as with the Moto G Pure, the new Moto G Power turns to MediaTek for its chipset. In the case of the Moto G Power, a MediaTek Alio G37 is running the show. It's probably not a coincidence that the same problems I experienced with the Moto G Pure's performance are also present in the Moto G Power 2022. Moto G Power 2022 Review Battery Life and Charging if the Moto G Power's performance is dismal, especially when compared to its predecessors, at least it still provides the long-lasting battery life we've come to expect from this family of phones. On our battery test, in which we have a phone surf the web continuously over cellular, T-Mobile LT in this case, the Moto G Power 2022 lasted 13 hours and 15 minutes before running out of power. Turning off its 90Hz refresh rate improved that time only slightly to 13 hours and 20 minutes. Moto G Power 2022 Review Software and Special Features The standard praise we have for Motorola's My UX interface applies to the Moto G Power 2022. My UX is a clean implementation of Android, and the few additions Motorola makes are welcome ones, such as gesture shortcuts to take screenshots, split your screen or turn on the flashlight. Wallpapers and styles let you personalize the look of your phone.